and then I'll proceed to untie this ma this dragonborn man. And Scar, as you first, I'll just take off the gag off of his mouth. So, uh, Scar, as you get into the room, you see. Talkative. Say that again. Oh, uh, he, I'm not very talkative. Whenever you first meet me. Uh, well, Scar, you're going. Uh, you were going to be uh, like a either adoptive brother or uh, just straight up like cousin of a uh, Scar, which is Josh. Uh, Sam, which is Drezik, and not Drezik, but Drach, and uh, Justin, which is uh, Drezik. On the subject, ass motherfucker. Sam. Sam. What? Don't forget your laundry. Can't do it. Paige is doing laundry. Well, I achieved the request that was given to me. Yep. So, Scar, you see Dalton who, uh, Dalton's character, uh, A1, who is your sibling in some capacity, whether it's adoptive or otherwise. Probably adoptive since he is a black dragon instead of a red. Racist. Okay, fine. He's just straight up your sad sister, and your sad is now canonly black dragon. <laughs> <sighs> Another sibling. Do we gotta kill this one too? Mm, I don't know. I, you seem to l always have to kill your siblings. Uh, I'm not entirely sure why. Maybe, maybe you should just uh, talk to them and maybe go to therapy. So, at the mission of kill, how big is the room that we're in? Uh, fifteen bucks. 15-foot diameter circle. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. Uh, what happens here? I have not a clue. Okay. I'll just kind of stand up and let my cloak just kind of circle around my body and just stare at them. That's a challenge. And uh, from outside the cave, you hear... Uh, Drezik yell, Woody! And uh, you also hear the doctor like, I'm going to help catch him, guys. And uh, you hear that coming from uh, the west side of the uh, walkways that you guys were on outside. Okay. Wait, Scar, I believe your Drezik is out there trying to hunt down Woody because Woody did the right thing and ran away. So there is that. So should we go catch them and then head back to town? Uh, and then uh, Willie uh, pops, uh, says, uh, uh, we also have that mission over in uh, Fail. Ah, yes, yes, Vale. The other town. Now yeah, we should stop by there to see what, what the mission was in the first place, and, th and then we can continue on to town. Uh, other dragonborn man, uh, do you have it? We can t help g take you to the town of Vale, so you could at least maybe find your way around. I assume that uh, you were probably kept here against your will. Uh, okay. It, it is safer to travel it together. I mean, when we got, when we were traveling here, we seen a lot of wildlife. Maybe, maybe we should drop them off at our keep. That is very far away, and I was hoping to get uh, Draj and the rest of your guys' family and just have you guys move to my keep. It would be much easier. Oh, I'm, I'm sure he'd like it. Yeah, I mean, looking at the blueprints I have, it just seems like they're like an extremely big three three story keep with uh, enough room to for everyone to have their own rooms and probably make an entire town out of a restaurant and 
and get you guys out of that town you're currently in. Maybe save some of the people, keep people from dying. But yes, having a key ball, which makes it seem a lot safer. Hey, my brothers don't kill everybody. They're throwing them a prom. Yes. Maybe we do it before that and get everyone to leave. <laughs> all right, let's go. Everybody got all their things? I have what's left. So I just hold my crossbow and my cloak and the clothing I took off of a dead bandit. <laughs> I'm just gonna kind of pat myself down. Mm, I'm good. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna look over. Your name was Wheelie, yes? Uh, yes. Or do you have everything, really? Oh, uh, I didn't have much well on me to begin with, so I just had, uh, you know, my uh, spellcasting components and uh, just a few days' rations. Okay, okay. Well, I got Scrump. I'm going to pick him up and then pick up the head of uh, your dead brother. And then we'll walk out. Okay. I'll follow. So, back to the world map. Uh, don't I don't know if you've actually had a chance to see the world map. Negative, good sir. So, this is the but world. I see it now. This is the world of uh, Dramundico. So oh, often, set a blaze to everything. Huh? What? Oh, uh, I, I thought you asked a question. No. Okay, so a bit of a distance up in the north, uh, you see uh, Dresic and the Doctor clear, uh, clearly chasing uh, Woody. Uh, they got a good distance ahead because they were already outside the building. Towards P? <laughs> well, Woody looks like he's running for his life. Doctor looks like he's having fun ch just being involved. And Dresic looks like he is after oh, Woody. Okay. Uh, but it's he's they're clearly going in a different direction. How then. far away? Oh, at this point, they're... Like a good uh, 600 feet, like. Oh, wow, that's really far. No, like uh, with just... the, you gathering, you guys gathering your stuff and the fact that they were already outside running. Oh. Whenever he heard the, uh, when you guys heard the scream. Well, I can't really stop them now. They're really far away. What if we just leave them out here and maybe they'll find their way back to town. I leave it up to you, Scar. I will leave the vote up to you. Leave them here or go track them down. Uh, we should probably grab them, but don't know. I will, I will cast Thaumaturgy to make my voice three times louder, and I'll just scream for them both, like, Hey, we're going to Vale, which is that way. N not the way you're headed, but slightly to your left. Well, I did what I could. <laughs> I'll just start walking to Vale. I'm going to send my homunculus to get them to tell them they're going the wrong way and start walking towards Vale myself. Okay. And then Dom's just following along the rest. I love how they definitely did not listen. <laughs> say yes. I mean, who's over there? I, wait, who is over in P? Dresic, the Doctor, and Woody. Dresic and the Doctor and Woody. And Woody's just running for his life. Yeah. Okay. So. On, on our travels... Literally, like, I guess an hour of walking, I'd be like, 
Uh, Dark Dragonborn Man, what what do we call you? Did Dom say he was getting up for some? I don't know. <laughs> Might have went and put the baby in the bath. I don't know. I just saw him, his little screen like. Oh, Mike is. Yep. Ah. <sighs> Ow. Okay. Can you guys hear me? Yep. Yes. Yes. Okay. Sorry about that. Uh, yeah, microphone issues. <laughs> Lovely. Um, so you asked what my name was? Yes. Charles? Okay. The, I don't uh, want to keep calling you the Black Dragonborn Man. I would appreciate that. Um, Awen? Oh, well, hello, Awen. I am in the key, so the bad. Arwen. Got it. Arwen. Yeah, whatever. And, and, and this is my friend Scar? And those two are running that way. The human one is named the Doctor. We still don't know why he doesn't have any medical license. And the other one, his name is Drezek. He is the brother to Drach. He is the friend who lives back in town. Not to this town we're going to. But, uh, yes. They are just a friend. Okay. And this, and this right here is Scrum. And Scrum and Draconic says... What the fuck you want? Okay. Everybody do the scrum flat. <laughs> how how big is scrum? Scrum is a small creature. And draconic. Like the size of a small dog. Tiny. Small dog that's, size. That's that's just what I say. And draconic, you are very, very tiny. And and draconic he says, I bet that's what you tell your penis. <laughs> And then he just crawls up on my shoulder. <laughs> you would make a delicious stew, little one. Oh, no, no, no. Scrump would not make good stew. Scrump is uh, not fully corporeal. But yes, if you want some uh, draconic jerky, I do have some. And I'll hold out some pieces of jerky. I'll take some. Sure. Why not? And uh, it, yes, Zach, that is pieces of his brother. <laughs> just kill. Oh, I don't give a shit. <laughs> Tasty. Okay, so uh, you guys make uh, progress towards uh, the town of Fail. Uh, as you approach the town, uh, it's. Not a walled city or a walled town at all. Uh, you don't see That's any... That's first mistake. <laughs> uh, you don't see anyone, uh, like, walking around town from a distance. Uh, you also don't... Uh, you don't hear anything either. It's almost a... Ghost Townisk. Okay. Damn. This place seems a little spooky. It's it's completely empty. Uh, you are still about, you know, 100, 200 feet uh, away from town, so. And the town is not tiny, but it's not huge. Uh, okay. It, it's a, it's like a medium small town. I will send Scrump, and let's see what he can see. So I will send Scrump. Scrump, you're going to go over to that building right there, and uh, go inside the front door, see what you could see, then come back. So, uh, obviously he complies with your order. Yep. Comes back, and it's like, Conveys to you that 
the town was ransacked, uh, the, not town, but the uh, house was ransacked, the door was busted open. And he well, said uh, there's also other doors that look like the same just down the street as well. What order, does anyone remember the quest we said we would definitely do coming to this town? Was it just no? No, no one. No one had. Per, I think it was like they haven't heard from the city in a while, so they wanted us to check on it, and we checked on it. It looks fucked. Maybe we can see if there's any survivors and take them back to town with us. Mm, so look for food. Got it. No, 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 no. If we find survivors, we can persuade them to come with us and come to a new land called Milky Land. <laughs> They would be indebted to us for saving them. We create a small tribe and just have them move up north. Could become gods to them. They could do sacrifices to us. No, 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 no. But have yes. them work as indentured servants, 100%. With sacrifices. No, no, no. I mean, they just work for, like, work for us. We give them barely enough to live with. And then they sacrifice to us, right? They don't need to sacrifice to us. No, no, no. Maybe they sacrifice, like, we pay them a little bit, but then they have to pay us back for living there. You know, be like landlords. Because landlords with their first are probably child. neutral good, right? <laughs> I'm trying to understand how to go from evil to good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm, we're going you to provide be... payment and housing, but they have to pay for the housing. With their first war child. If that's how they're paying, and then we put that child into indentured servitude, yes. And they slowly will pay off this debt. And uh, soon they will be completely free citizens. Motherfucker, we're going to run this like Tom Nook. Those bitches ain't never going to get out of debt. So, uh... <laughs> last thing that, uh... Scrump went ahead and said. Oh, that works too. Uh, but the last thing Scrump did say about town is it did. He said it looked like there was a the uh, center of town had some activity going on. Okay. Oh well, fuck it. Let's go to the center of town. I'm gonna start walking. Okay. Sounds good. I'm going to follow him while I tinker. Make sure my crossbow is loaded. <laughs> I'm making my usual. Okay, uh, how about we have you guys roll some stealth rolls? Beautiful. Disadvantage plus eight. <laughs> Oh, it's not a disadvantage anymore. I don't have arm. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I forgot I have no arm. Sweet. I got a 21. Yeah. <coughs> also, uh, Charles, if you'll roll for uh, Scrumpy Scrump. Yeah, I can roll for Scrump. I'm the stealthiest here so far. It's because I'm not paying attention to anything, so I'm, uh, I'm blocking everything out as I work. Just... Scrump got a four. So, uh, I, luckily I was actually doing the group stealth, so... Group? Yeah. Okay. So even though the two non-player characters both failed, we still, uh, you still had enough successes. Scrump knocks over a trash can. Everybody looks at him and thinks he's a cat. <laughs> okay, so you guys actually get into the position you... Uh, did it switch over to my... Uh... We're on a different map, but... It... Oh, there's our tokens. Okay. There's some people about to summon a thing. <sighs> okay, so... Uh, you guys get to this position. You are cur You have currently not alerted to anyone. 
What do we see? Uh, you see a magical circle with a green dragon in the middle of it. I can't put it exactly in the middle, unfortunately. No, you're fine. Uh, there's That's a small ass green dragon. <laughs> uh, it is currently wormling size. Okay. Uh, you see a total of uh, you see all the uh, tokens. So those are prisoners. Uh, so each of those are actually an acolyte from a opposing order <laughs> that Milky is aware of. Mm. So I recognize. I did not people. mean to do that. Uh, so this is the order that's trying to raise the dragons. Okay. Try to uh, raise and restore the dragons to wipe out the unworthy humans. Hmm. Hmm. My people. Hmm. Hey, friends, friends. Uh, these people, people aren't right? good people. Uh, what they're trying to do is kill all dragon kind in an attempt to bring Tiamat back and everybody knows you, you cannot kill all dragon kind to make her come back that will make her come back in anger you must and create Tiamat a Tiamat is the god that my brother follows it, uh, yes yes I have talked in length with your brother about this but uh, hey Zach you have to yeah. create a worthy vessel so would my character know these people as evil or like, have I heard anything about them? So, they are... They're not after restoring Tiamat, they're after restoring the natural order. Which dragons were far above. Now, don't get me wrong, they, uh... They do believe that Tiamat is the Great Mother, so Tiamat could expedite the process. But they're also, uh... Still trying to figure out how to do so. Oh, uh, who had that little, uh... Oh. Token. Raise with an S. Do I do this? Do who I had do what? this? Uh, who had the uh, little uh, figure, the magical figure? I have the figurine. Huh. Oh, whenever uh, you got near Dalton, uh, you feel the figure shaking. Like the, whenever you got, whenever you first got, every time you get near him. And uh, okay. Dalton, uh, one of the special items that I put in your pocket, in your inventory, uh -huh. also shakes. Also, Erwin, every time I get near you, this little like figurine I have, and I'll hold it out. It keeps it keeps vibrating. Ah, you got a vibrator. I'm still looking at the center group, That's not look like a decision, fit. and I'm just gonna kind of casually, just like, yeah, I have something vibrating too. Mm. We'll figure that out later. So, so I'm currently Zach. debating if yeah. these guys are good or evil. What do I need to roll to? You meant to raise, as in they bring them up to live, right? Uh, pretty much, they are trying to. Like that. That's what you've heard. You haven't actually okay. not not raise as an eradicate. Not with, not with a Z. Up. Okay. With an S, not a Z. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Never mind. My information is wrong. They don't kill dragons. They, they like to raise them, but they do kidnap a lot of them from my, where I live. Or where I'm from. You know, so, um, would you kill on, them? Usually, my, the, the knights, uh, yes, we kill them because they okay. usually have dragons we can raise better than them. Uh, okay, that just made my decision. Um, also, on the opposite uh, side over here, uh, you do see a cage where you see the town folk laying. Uh, Zach? Yeah. Can I do something? Sure. What are you trying to do? Uh, okay. Can everybody in this circle, like, right here, make a dexterity saving throw for me? Nice. You're fucking fireballing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I will Wait, get... Friend, do you want us to work together? See, 
I can make it to where they won't be able to see, and then they won't be able to dodge away from things they can't see. Oh, well, they're also. What you said um, that the knights in your town kill them. I decided I'm gonna kill them regardless. I'm not. I'm not like announcing what I'm doing. I'm oh, just okay. raising my hand and firing. Never mind. Have fun. That's fine. With this, well, I'm gonna hit all of them because I'm aiming for the center and, and activating my deal. It's a twenty. Oh, like, God. I was sitting here measuring out, like, because I'm putting it right here in the center. I think you would miss. You okay? Yeah. yeah. What's wrong? Yeah, there's no more. Cats have found a spider and are chasing it across the floor. <laughs> Let the cats get the spider. No, it's a brown spider. Oh. It's not a wolf spider. It's just oh, a brown house spider. It's a big one. Yeah, recluse is a bit of bad issue spider. this year. I've only seen brown house spiders this year. Uh, if it's brown, it's probably. It's brown. Okay. Does it have so a big butt or a slender butt? Uh, sorry, I'm actually still getting the last couple it. things. Because it's going to be directly from the center. 10, 10, 15. Yay, destruction. So whenever uh, you cast it, it. You did see a dome appear over the top. Now the act, the uh, five people, the five people are actually standing outside it, so they're still. Okay. Oh, it's over there. My god, my computer is lagging so much. Aiden, it's okay, buddy. Oh, he ran. okay. He, he's trying to voice the displeasure of the green dragon. What? Yeah. Oh, uh, what's your DC? Oh shit, that's right. Let me see. Uh, 15. Sorry, I just have to roll two more. The, the, it's, a uh, <laughs> uh, two succeeded, and with that, we are going to go ahead, roll initiative. Do you want me to roll damage real fast? Yeah, go ahead, roll the damage. Or roll initiative first. Whichever you want. I, I've just been getting ignored, so I just kept going without you guys. Did you? Sorry, did you say something? Dax just ignoring me again. I'm not ignoring you, I'm asking. Well, yeah, I said I was going to go back to Aiden. Sorry, like, sorry, I couldn't hear you over that. I can't even pull out my gun the moment he casts it, so. Sorry, what? Okay, so you were. Okay, that's fine. The moment he cast that spell, I pulled out my gun and my cannon. Okay. So, Yorn did something to it, unless it was playing dead, because when Ella walked away from it, and it was upside down on its back. Did it have a big butt or slender butt? It was a small butt, but I don't know if it was a brown or fish. Did it have black stripes down its ass? Did it have black stripes down its ass? I don't I think so. Then it might have been. It looked like that. Yes. Okay. So it looked like that. But it was a smaller version, yeah. Okay, it was a baby brown recluse. Ooh, that was fun. No, they haven't uh, crowded there yet. Uh, I know several people who've been. I was not about to set him in the playpen when there was a spider on the floor. Um, spider on the ear. I know several people who've gone to the emergency rooms with fights like that. And one. He just gouged it open. 
Ugh. That'd be Sam. But Sam ain't listening. <laughs> I just had to cut it open. Find yourself with the realization. Oh, when the if you guys what we're going to do, let me know. I'm going to start reading my book. Oh, that was noisy. I'm trying to get the initiative tracker. I heard no. about butter. No. I provided. Provided. For Charles, Ooh. have you watched the anime by the grace of the gods? No. It's real cutesy. It's only twelve episodes. It's like the wholesome good feels. Okay. I've been reading the light novels for it, and they cut out some interesting shit. <laughs> like at one point. He freaking beat up a gang of the other adventurers who were picking on people and bound and gagged them with actual gags in their mouth. <laughs> and this is an 11 year old. Uh, like, Josh, did you decide to move up to that position or did you just move to be able to click on your token? I was moving to that position. Do I need to re-roll my initiative since I disappeared from the turn order? No, you're on top, aren't you? No. I see a 9, a 6, and a 3. Am I not going? Okay, uh, so it showed me for you guys twice. So I deleted two of the... No. I got a 23, that's why. I'll re-roll yeah, the turn order. No, I, uh, I, it's like, I can add you. I was just, uh, no, you're good. I, I just saw two. Oh, okay. I saw two results for both of you. after the fireball immediately goes off, uh, me and Scar just immediately go into action. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I stay exactly here. Scar just fucking takes the money. Okay, so, uh, dog. Yes, too used to dog, you brothers. Yeah. Uh, that fireball immediately killed three of the, uh, people who were chanting. I'm glad. Uh, so, uh, at the, uh, so starting initiative is, uh, Milky. Okay. I'm, I'm very last. At this guy, and I'm gonna fucking pull back and shoot. Okay. What class are you, Charles? I'm a ranger. Nice. Nice. I can finally fucking hit this time, guys. <laughs> I'm in twenty six to hit. You should not be on the front lines. Get man, man, Charles, it would suck if that missed. It would. You want me to do something about that? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> okay, okay uh, go ahead. Roll your damage. Roll damage. I got to make sure because uh, I get a plus two damage bonus, but it will not take into account on this because dumb stuff. So roll damage and then plus two. Uh, a total of eight. Okay. I mean, he was already pretty sent, so. Okay. And then 
Yeah, because I moved Scrump as that was like the beginning of turn. So Scrump has moved there, and that is all Scrump will do. And I think that's all I'll do for my turn. Okay, then we're moving on to uh, Scar. I guess I was a move here, since he's killing everybody close to me. I'm not sorry. Don't you have a gun? Yes. Okay. That's what you do. I shoot the people so you can just keep running forward. Anywho, I'm going to try to use my gun to shoot it in the face. I got a 24. Man, you guys are actually hitting for once. I know. Did I successfully shoot it in the face? You successfully shoot it. Avatar of Death. I don't think we can lose anymore. I, I did five points. That that is the most. Uh, I mean, you still uh, killed it. Like those guys were <laughs> pretty damaged to begin with. Yeah, success. We win. Damn, I got close for nothing. I was gonna use my freaking cannon too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess. That's all I'm doing for now. So what happens to the magic circle? <laughs> or was the dragon know, casting the magic dragons. circle to keep the people out? <laughs> so, uh, you hear from uh, <laughs> the other five acolytes that they are, con they pretty much are continuing a chant. Oh, okay. So it's clear that the acolytes are making the magic circle. Okay. And, uh, so uh, on their turn, uh, you notice that the dragon is getting larger. Oh, okay. Making a bigger dragon. It's becoming more material. Uh, it's just growing in size. Goes from a medium, it's from small to a medium, and then medium to a large. So, you see that the dragon, it looks like they has been chanting for a while, so now it has moved to a large size. Oh, wow, it actually fits at the center now. <laughs> <laughs> Question. Does the body shape still technically look like a wormling? It looks like it's maturing acid? faster. Oh, maturing, okay. It looks like it's hmm. magically... Uh, it's magically aging. Okay. I'm going to look at Scrump. I'm going to look at the circle. I'm going to look at Scrump. No. <laughs> Might be the only way I can get Scrump big enough so I can ride Scrump into battle. <laughs> Although it would be level 18. Okay, so uh, now, uh, now I have to do some measurements. Hey, did my uh, homunculus ever reach them? Uh, do you have uh, do you have a, like a telepathic connection with it? Yes. So the homunculus caught up to it. Uh, a fight, but this was after uh, Dresica caught up to Woody during the fight. The doctor got a scratch, and then Dresic went like feral, and he has now like he is currently eating them both after killing them. Oh, huh. so only Scar no or yeah, only Scar knows this shit. Fun little tidbit for you. <laughs> just I'm just gonna thank to my uh, homunculus to stay out of reach. And focus on what I'm doing. So it happens directly right there. You're like, oh, oh god, what happened? <laughs> I feel like I'm being targeted. <laughs> I feel like you're being targeted because you're the only melee class out there. And by melee class, I'm quotations around that. Okay, so... Yeah, we so have... I'm the artificer who focuses 
focuses mainly on long range attacks. It's up in the front. Row. I don't know why you did. <laughs> we could just kept shooting from this corner and bottleneck them. Okay, so. Uh... <laughs> Scara, I'm going to need three wisdom saves from you, and Scrump needs two wisdom saves, please. Okay. Let's go Scrump. Good-ass wisdom. Wait, why did it say wisdom whenever it's a... It's a dex save instead. So if your dex is... If the dex is better, you can re-roll if you want to take. Otherwise, uh... Did it to the deck save, I'll do a deck save. I'm gonna do it this way. You're only supposed to do three, not four. Oh, there we go. There you go. I got a 20, a 7, and an 18. Uh, those numbers are incorrect. They also add a plus two. Oh, wait, no. Is that adding? Let me see. Uh, it's not adding it. So yeah, plus two. So it's a 16 and a 19. Uh, my so, Scar, you take four radiant damage from the one that you rolled a seven on. But uh, it's a uh, flame-like uh, light is coming from, uh, descending from the sky onto the spots that you are. So just like Light meteors. Huh. And, uh... Uh, the... Now, uh, the dragon is thrashing about inside the magic circle and it appears it cannot get out. And it's, uh, back to Awen. Okay, so I would like to cast Chromatic Orb on this guy right here. And then use two point use two sorcerer sort sor sorcery points because I'm casting it at a level two to you to uh do twin spell to get it over on to this guy right here. Okay, I am gonna have you do one thing because uh this area right here is a cage full of people. Uh-huh. I'm gonna go ahead and have you do a DC twelve arcane check. To try to get the uh, spell to materialize behind it instead of just having to plow through it. <laughs> I mean, if you want, if you want, you can say that. That's fine. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I heard DC arcade check. And then we want you to roll a deal to see so, whether or not you're going to spare the people. Like, if you want to hit the... If you don't care about hitting the people, then you don't have to roll it. But if you're tr uh, if you're trying to hit them, if you're trying to hit the people, you're trying to pretty much bend the spell. Because there's a barrier in front of it. I got right. a 12. Uh, meets beats, so... So, yeah, you are able to uh, cast the spell going uh, and hitting those... He uh, has been defeated by a cat. All right, so let me. We'll do S. Hold on. Medic orb. Uh, does a fourteen hit? Yes. Cool. Now, whenever I do twin spell, do I need to roll to hit again, or? Uh, click on display spell on a VTT. Well, no, it's not a spell. Oh, I'm, uh, I'm talking about the metamatic feed. Or I meant the metamatic feed. Just go to your metamatic and it, can, it should say uh, display. Class. Uh, it. 
to, oh, there we go. Okay, twin. When you, uh, uh, no, that was, uh, when you cast spell for you. Oh, yeah, it does require a, spell, a separate check. Okay, so that's, so the first one was for the first guy. Let's go ahead and do the second one. 20. Okay, yeah, both hit. I go ahead, roll uh, two sets of damages. Yep, that's the damage for the first. And then that's the damage for the second. Ah, got and it. And it is acid, acid damage. Oh, I, I can see why I'm having issues. I'm still measuring. <laughs> I'm sitting here like, this motherfucker hit me with the goddamn light. The fuck? No. Okay, so that one died. The other one still lives. Oh, well, damn it. Do I have any bonus actions that I can do? No, I cannot. All right, yeah, that's the end of mine. Okay, then it brings it around back to Milky. Okay, I'm going to look at the center of that. Uh, do I need to roll an arcane check to figure out if that magic circle is keeping the dragon inside? Like, for a reason. To make it grow. Uh, go like, ahead, roll a DC 15 yeah. arcane check. Okay. Let's go with a minus one. Let's see. Mm. It's Ooh, nice. oh, You got it. Let's stare at the magic. So it looks like it is a three-part spell. Okay. First off, it obviously has the uh, magical dragon maturing component. Okay. It is that it, and then it has a double layer barrier, an inside and outside barrier. Oh, okay, so nothing can get in and nothing can get out. Damn. Yeah, like it, it has like a thin anti magic barrier that will keep stuff okay. uh, from, like you can't even like have magic like appear inside there because it is. Okay. Mm. I I is angry. I want to do my. Now, it does look like each time you killed an Acolyte, it's obviously getting weaker. Okay. Like, you can start, like, uh, with that, uh, with it down to being four people, you can visibly see magic start. The magical s sphere, dome, and magical circle start, like, cracking. Okay. But it is still going for now. Let's let it out. Hey, hey, hey. Yes, hey. We, we should let that out to the dragon, but also we should make sure we keep at least one person alive. No. To keep the spell slightly Question. working. Has Sam's character done anything? Sam's, Sam's character's, character's not, here. not here. He's just here to show support. Yep. That's why he hasn't talked. He's actually watching YouTube videos. He's just here <laughs> in spirit. His Ooh. character is still back in the town. Not this town, the other town. Uh, uh, is he's talking to the gangsters. He's in Monsombra Town. Ah, yeah, Monsombra. I will peek around. He's in my turn yet. Uh, it's Milky's turn. Shoot this guy. I'll step right there and shoot that guy. Do it. Rolling, 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 rolling. 23. That hits. That's 7 <laughs> plus 2 for 9 damage. Okay, he is still up. Okay. By 10. And then I will step back in here and I'm going to say, Scrump, go try and get inside. 5, 10, 15. So he's going to get right there and start scratching at the fucking barrier. Uh, pretty much he, he ran, ran, and he like hopped to try to jump onto it. And uh, he like slides down slowly. And the... uh. 
dragon kind of thrashes at him, just bang. Okay. Uh, scrum, tell it we mean it to no harm. And Scrump will just look at the dragon and be like, we're not here to fuck you. That's about it. You're not, I am. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, the dragon leans back. Uh, have Scrum... Uh, I, I I guess roll perception to read lips. Perception? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> Wouldn't that be a wisdom? Nah. That would be perception. I'm trying to see. Oh, yeah. I'm tired. No, Here I'm looking is. at something else on here oh. on my sheet. Uh. I read wrong. No, that, that doesn't apply in this situation. That's to recall information, so never mind. Uh, perception. I'm trying to hear what I can see here. I'm guessing nothing. <laughs> you can't hear you over the cackling and the uh, oh, uh, behind me. So, uh, for uh, the 10? Yeah. I mean, this was only a DC 10. Oh, okay. you, you pretty much, you see the dragon point towards its ears... And like shake his head, like okay, the stereotypical "I can't hear you." <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, but yes, Scar, it is now your turn. As you come right here, yes. Okay, so I'm going to cast Scorching Ray. Okay. Two hits. Cool. I'm hit that punk, this punk. Make the bubbly. Oh yeah, gotta turn that off. Two seconds. This guy and this guy. Those two. Those two were hit. Uh, what's the damage? That's the damage. <laughs> Okay. So uh, one more went down. And then I'm going to have my freaking uh, uh, Eldritch Cannon use Flamethrower on the one next to me. Do it. So he needs to roll a deck save. <sighs> uh, got a 14. Alright, so he only takes half that. Okay, so he's still standing then? Let's see. Is there anything else I can do? He gets everything. Yeah, that's all I can do for now. Okay, I'm good. I'm amused. I've killed one and wounded two. Okay, we go to the Acolyte's turn. And just, just so we're clear, when I cast that, it looked like the glowing orbs were coming out of the pistol. Okay. Okay, so that effect does not recharge. Let's 
So uh, all three of the remaining ones are going to cast a Sanctuary spell on themselves. They gonna try to hide like little bitches? Uh... Yeah, so, uh... And, uh, let's go ahead, roll a DC 25... I'm gonna go ahead, roll a DC 25 strength roll on, uh... And see if the dragon break out of it. With lots of people. Yeah. It was right next to the nat 20 as it was sliding. <laughs> Okay, the K the barrier is still strong enough to hold the dragon inside. For now. For now. Awen, it is your turn. Dalton. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. Uh so this one right here, I want to cast Chill Touch. Let's see if I finish them off. 22. Oh, yeah, that hits. Nine damage. Does it kill him? Yep. Sweet. I'm just going to have the hand wrap around his neck and just kind of... Nap it. Yeah. With its chilly... Skeletal bullshit. I can't do any of my long distance touch spells because my homunculus ain't here. Anything else you were going to do? I, um, That's about all I can do. I had to learn long distance touch spells because everybody else got restraining orders against me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Milky, back around to you. Okay. Uh, so it looks like that thing's trying to break out. Uh, Scrump will attack the uh, barrier and attempt to break it to go inside. Uh, that is a now it is a DC twenty strength check. Strength check? Ooh, let's see. How strong is Scrump? Fuck is Scrump. Scrump, why do you keep disappearing? Yeah. Uh, you have a 16. Ooh, why the fuck haven't I been doing anything with this? Let's go, scrum. <laughs> Fucking natural one. It's just like... <laughs> <laughs> so, as Scrum was uh, winding up to get, do a full charge, uh, slipped on some of the blood from uh, some of these early oh, attacks and, like, slipped in and right ran here. into it. What the... Uh, then I will, I guess, uh, I'll shoot this guy because we keep shooting this guy. Might as well. Okay. Uh, but I, uh, Scar, do not move at all. I'm going to curve this. <laughs> <laughs> that's a, that, that's a miss. You were a little bit too worried about it. So it's gonna like, hey, and it's shot into the building next to me. That thing is the oh, armor class is only mind. eleven. <laughs> so close. Uh, oh, uh, that's what my turn is. What the fucking two? Okay, Scar. All right, so I'm gonna shoot at this guy over here with the freaking uh, pistol. See if I can keep my roll going here. It's long enough to hit. Uh, twelve, yeah. Nine points. Is he alive? Uh, 
No, that that should have been enough to kill him. No, no. All right, and then if you didn't guess, my cannon's going off on the other guy again. So he needs to roll a deck saving throw. You're in my spot. You don't know how to play Loki. It was hard to play game. Uh, he fell. Oh, yeah, not a problem. Don't worry Okay, so I think we're already fouling. He takes 10 points of crispy damage. 10 points of crispy damage? One of our players playing health and. Oh, I man, say no more. I got you. And as the door fall, this. Hey, Dalton, I can hear your TikToks. Okay. Oh, sorry, I thought I muted. Okay. Uh, that's the final one. And with this, the dragon is free! <laughs> I'm gonna look over at the dragon. The like, hey, can you get out now? Oh, the magic circle dissipates. Oh, Scrump gets sad. <laughs> And, uh, so we can just remove those guys, and now it's Dragon's turn. Uh, all I really need is to delete the one that I had set for the turn. Yeah. That one guy. The one that Scrump is standing next to. Ah, uh, freedom. You're welcome. What the hell is with all those weird people? Do you know? Well, like I said, they're all the weirdos. I'm not asking you, I'm asking the dragon. Okay. Well, the information that I could glean from being captured, they just wanted to grow me to the greatest size of dragons possible. But it's caused quite a bit of pain. I mean, growing pains are a bitch. They can be. So what are you going to do now? Well... Out of respect, if you want to leave this town, I shall eat all these bodies, and then I will find uh, my way back home. I'm just going to kind of make my way over to this cage. Yeah, you can eat all the dead ones, but for us to succeed in our mission, I ask that you leave the live ones alone. Uh, Dalton, uh, make a quick yeah. medicine check since you're, since you're the closest to the cage. Ow. Okay. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> So what you I'm literally just over here. You walked over, you looked in there, and literally you turned to the rest of the group and pretty much just like they're dead. They dead. Oh, are they all dead already? Oh yeah. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna cast uh create oh. bonfire in the middle of the bonfire. No no no, wait, wait, let's see if there's anything salvageable first. I I'm gonna walk over here because I, I I'm gonna have to <laughs> check this out. Why would they have a cage of dead people? I mean good food is kept in do any of them look like they are draconic in any sense? We store our food in a well. Uh, so, no. It, Why would you do that? There was a variety, but it doesn't look like there's any Yuantai or uh, uh, okay. Dragonborn. Okay, so do I notice anything with my eight roll? <laughs> <laughs> Just looking inside. Yeah, they all look dead. Nah. Uh, Milky, do you no, want to be uh, helping to observe for the medicine? To give him advantage? If you want, yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and have you roll again and see. We're all if just it's... kind of staring in here. I'm just like, are any of them dragonborn? I mean, or any yeah. lizard folk. You know what the issue just is? Stick. The issue is the doctor's not here. Yep. All right, I got a 13 with Milky. The doctor's out. dead. The doctor is dead. Uh, so with the 13, they look like 
they were pretty much put in the cage and just left there with no food, no nothing. But, uh, it looks like most of them died from a poison that they, and you see a few bottles of, uh, empty bottles on the ground. Now, it looks like this- Trump is licking one of them. <laughs> uh, it looks like this happened about a day ago. So there's no living people. Yeah, everyone in the cage is dead. All right, I checked all the pockets to see if anybody has any money, including the weird acolyte people. I'm just going to take one of their robes. Eh. Now, this, is, this could be proof enough of like what happened in the town, right? I mean, we can take the dragon with us and have look proof the dragon. there. Well, that's up to no, the dragon. He, I'm not going to force him to go with us. He, he is meant to be part. free. I'm not because saying force. Creature. I'm not saying force. We, the drag, we can what? ask the dragon to come with us uh, and dragon say friend. what happened. Uh, what, is, what, what, what is the name you wish us to call you? You, you have name, yes? I am Svin. Svin? S-V-E-N. Svin. Svin. Well, Svin, um, would you like to go with us? A. There is a B option and a C option and a D option. Either A, you you, you come with us. Chomp. And, <laughs> just, and, uh... I'm gonna bring him this body. Uh, B... I could tell you the area of this really cool keep that you can go to right now, and anyone there you could just eliminate and kill. I really don't care. It, I technically own the keep. Uh, monsters. And yeah, there's probably some stuff there, and honestly, if you clear it out for me, uh, I'm, I'm about to go back to town and get a bunch of people to come there, and we can, like, pay you tribute for, like, protection. Charles, so, real quick, out of game... Idea. Did you draw the card that a deed pops in your hand? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> after I drew the card that changes my alignment, and after I drew the card that des destroys all non-magical items. <laughs> so I have real bad luck, but good luck. And then after that, I drew the card that, uh, that makes the Avatar of Death come out and want to kill me. I drew a card and I got a cool jewel. Well, a cool yeah. uh, power-up. <laughs> And there were also several duds. Uh, yeah. And I also drew the card that uh, makes it where I do not gain a level up. I actually lose all experience I've gained so far. Well, so, it's an exact amount game. of experience that they take away. But yeah. since I'm doing milestone, that didn't that didn't apply. Mm -hmm. So this next time, it, it, it takes away a very specific amount to the point that you would not lose a level, but do not gain a new level. That, that is what it says. I don't so. know if last piece of cake, but like, it's for cake. I know. Anywho, so Zach, do I find any monies? Uh, let's roll for how much. That is funny. Uh, let's let's not go too crazy. Whoops. Why am I going crazier? Okay. Wow, that was a bad roll. Uh, between all the bodies, town folk and acolytes, there was only 52 gold. More than what I have. Okay, uh, so that's, that's option B. Is uh, Sven, you could just go to the keep. And again, we would pay you for protection. It, it, it's, a, it's a whole thing that we could do. Um, then there is option C, where... Ah, this is this is gross, and uh, he <laughs> spits something at in your direction. In my direction? Yeah, and it's a uh, green dragon head figure, or green dragon head, and ah. your little figure is shaking. Well, I'm gonna grab that. Thank you. I'm gonna pull the figure and attach the head. Yeah, and uh, once it got like once it got like touched, it just magic flash of it just connected okay. magic flash and tiny roar. Okay, that's cool. Um, option C is you just leave. Uh, that is it. Okay. Or option D is uh, I kill you, sacrifice you to Tiamat, and eat your heart. 
I prefer the first two. I'm just gonna cut for B. I'm just gonna kind of casually turn and look at you with like an expression of, "Are you really fucking saying option D?" As I'm standing within biting range of this thing. <laughs> no, 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 me, me. I would fight it. It, it is a whole thing of my my people. We 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 raise dragons. To... Don't feel bad. He asked all of us. I, 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 only the things that are, I view as strong, I'm supposed to kill and eat their hearts to become the worthy vessel for Tiamat to return. So yes, at the, the moment of he saying, you talking about sacrificing. I don't want to. I, I would prefer you just go to the keep. Want me to make a persuasion check? Make a persuasion check at disadvantage. Question. Question then about that can i um, help him with that my, fa by, like, my favorite that foe insane. is dragons could i have because every i'm supposed to get advantage on things dealing with dragons do i get advantage on this dude cancel it out because of the disadvantage so yeah what, would it and cancel it can i help him by like looking at the dragon and be like he's a little bit insane he would never attack you uh pretty much don what you would do would not have an impact because you, multiple accounts of advantage don't stack. Pretty much one disadvantage would negate 74 advantages. Gotcha. So is, is it just solid across? Or am I really disadvantaged? <laughs> it's like, I, I'm pretty sure. It technically says that I gain a uh, favorite enemy is I have advantage on survival checks to track down my favorite enemies. Yeah, so this isn't a survival That's, check. Okay. I mean, I, 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 it's, it's so weird how it's specific on that, but yes. I well, I mean, roll. to be fair, it makes sense to try to track, but trying to talk to the thing that you yeah. want to kill doesn't make as much sense. Uh, but Dalton can negate the disadvantage for you. I'm just rolling. Whatever I got, I got. Got 19. Do not worry, friend. He Again, will not kill you. No, no, no. I do not wish to kill you. Can go there to the four options. And live there with us whenever we get it and we out give you money. We, we will definitely pay you for any services rendered, like protection. His broke kind of ass thing. will attempt to pay you. No, no, no. I won't. Uh, not me specifically, because I, I'm the one that owns the keep. The people we're renting to, they will give us money, and we will give that money a portion of it to the dragon. Because it just makes sense. We're going to feed you. You also get the master bedroom. Pretty much you take over the uh, whatever area in the keep you want. Make it into your throne area. So, what I'm going to do... What? I just realized that Sam ran away. I mean... It happens. Uh... Yeah. What I'm going to do is I'm going to, like I said, eat all these bodies, but I'm not going to go fight your battle for you. Would you like to show up after we're done? <laughs> what well, I'm going to go to, uh, He's going to uh, go ahead. Uh, he's going to say, I'm going to go to a uh, Rasun cave. Uh, if you guys want to go where ahead. This came from? Huh? <laughs> Isn't that where we just came from? No. That was Dragonborn Sanctum. Oh, that was Dragonborn Sanctum. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> so, uh, where I was. Go ahead, roll a uh, nature check or survival up. Uh, and we'll see if you know the geography well enough. Can I roll as well? Yeah, anyone can, because he's saying it out loud to where. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm I've got 20. I don't know where that is. <laughs> I, do. I, 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 the I was kind is. of raised in a commune with uh, all the people there. This this is Rishun Cave. So it's actually not terribly you're, far from. You're in luck. I know. Oh, it's across the water it from the keep. Oh, it is? Yeah. Well, that, that, that could work. Uh, we could come say hi every once in a while. I'm going to be like, hey, can I at least get a couple of scales to prove what happened here? Because there's like no survivors for, to tell what the fuck happened. And we can bring back the dead people. No, they already stink. <laughs> oh, that's true. Uh, go ahead. 
Scar, you can go ahead and make a persuasion. This will be a flat persuasion, like... Because he's got a little bit friendlier too. <laughs> I can't say I, bl I blame you. You will, you will not get any scales off mine. Do you not see how wondrously emerald green these scales are? Well, I need something to prove to these people what happened, and I don't really feel like dragging back dead bodies. By the way, you can eat what's in the cage too, but be warned, some of them drink poison. Oh, uh, Scrump is currently licking one of their faces. <laughs> oh, poison is not an issue, as you see uh, this green liquid that's not acidic just <sighs> dripping out from his fangs. Oh, can I bottle some of that and use that as evidence? God fucking damn it. <laughs> 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 Fourteen. He's like, so, uh, Finn's like, uh, one moment. He shakes his head a little bit, and he, uh, spits out a couple dragon fangs. Ooh, cool. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, the, the, my baby fangs, uh, that, that no, spell, had, that spell had a weird effect. I guess you did grow pretty fast. I'll pick up the baby things. Like, this will work as I uh, Hey, Zach. Can I look at the... Arc can I look at the circle that um, the dragon was in and see if I can determine what type of magic was being used? Uh, it was... Uh, it disappeared immediately when the last uh, acolyte died. Well, diggity fuck me. Okay, I would like to go... Pull some blood from the from the humans in the cage and put it in vials. Just study later. Are there are okay. vials on the ground in the cage. That there are vials. Oh, I have my own vials. Okay. I'm gonna collect those vials on the floor then, since he doesn't want them. Oh, I never said I didn't want them. I'm just saying I have my own vials. All right, well then take them. I Let's am. This. I'm gonna I'm gonna whisper to Scrum. Hey, Scrum. You should go over there to the dragon and attempt to take one of his scales off of his le off of his like toes or something like that. So where he won't notice it. Maybe so how many tail. fangs do I have? Up uh, four. Uh, have Scrump roll a stealth. <laughs> okay. Eighteen. You're fortunate that the dragon rolled extremely low because the dragon gets that big bonus to perception. Ah, you're right. So, Scrump sees one loose scale on the back of the he up on his back hill. First man. Yeah. And uh, goes, bats it off. Not actually hitting uh, Finn. Puts the skull in his mouth. The full skull in his mouth. Yep, just harp. And uh, just walks away like not even any of the skull is sticking out. <laughs> Perfect. And strolls back over to you and just looks at you very like, I did it boss but I can't say anything. Okay. okay. Good job, good job. Because I can talk to him uh, telepathically, so that's fine. 
Okay. The dragon rips open this cage and is just like going to town. Nice. Before uh, or after I take blood? Well, Before you said you were taking blood before he even stole the scale, so I'm going to say probably after. Okay. Yeah, you probably have time to get three or four miles before he uh, gets it. He breaks into the cage. Cool. And be like, well, Sven, we're going to head back to our hometown. We will visit you when we go to the keep. Uh, come, come afterwards. I, I don't want to be. I don't feel like being involved. All right. No we'll problem. We will not involve you in things that aren't uh, involved. Uh. It's not your fight. Understandable. Uh, also going to, uh, I guess, look around this place. See if there's anything we could, re- like, I guess, take with us. The town is useless now, so might as well get that what we true. can. And <gasps> so much supplies. Just supplies and anything like that we could use and carry. I'm going to look for a horse. Maybe some and armor because I don't have any. So, uh, what is it? If you haven't guessed, we're raiding this entire fucking town at this point. <laughs> it's empty. There's nobody to no tell people. us no. So regarding horses, all the horses were killed. Damn. Any donkeys? Oh, no. Any cows? No, honestly, this town is now devoid of life besides you and the dragon. I mean, you could probably find some mice if you really wanted to try. Well, let's see what's cool that we can carry. Yep, see what we find, sir, I guess. What are we looking at? Uh, investigation? Just to yep. investigate the town? Ooh, my fucking minus one for this. Yeah, yeah. I'm looking for gold, silver, alcohol. I'm specifically looking for, like, armor and weapons. <laughs> Try to find something that can wear. Looking for anything I can sell. Hey, I got a 20. I guess the music is no longer appropriate since it's no longer creep. Oh no, we are raiding the town. <laughs> a night of good rolls. Yeah, you guys rolled quite a bit better than I expected. Remember when it came to most of our intelligence, then we sucked. Oh yeah, you guys did not have big brain. Wise. You guys could not big brain. <laughs> oh, no big brain. Let me generate a pile of loot, you fucking thing. That's too on the nose. I hate it. What? Just bottles of poison. That's all we find. <laughs> no, uh, you do, you do find a. Uh, who ha- is someone doing detect magic right now? Is it? Is there an internal uh, detect magic going on? I, I will after we collect all our stuff, like we do, every, like I do every time. Okay, so. So you do find. 
two uh uh two jars of liquid you find a couple sets of fine clothes you find a you find actual the smith the smith out the blacksmith house nice which uh, gives you a full set of smith tools if you so choose yes yes i do uh It looks like, uh, if you look at the logs in the smith house, it explains the lack of weapons here besides, like, a single longsword. As he had uh, they had just sent a large shipment of weapons to the capital. There is a total of 549 gold. A ring... And a set of mat a set of musical pipes. Can I tell what the so just musical pipes? Huh? Do we have any buds? Well, once you uh, get the uh, once you get everything together, if you choose to bring that, uh, the. You After see, we get everything gathered, I'm going to cast uh, Detect Magic. So that's uh, the... So four of the items glow. Uh, the two uh, liquids, the two jar of liquids, the ring, <laughs> and the pipes. All right, do I recognize any of these two passings I have, or do I need to roll me an arcana? So, uh, the, uh, Detect Magic would give you the School of Magic. And I hate the Schools of Magic. Uh, the pipes get a uh, ring of uh, illusion magic. Weird. Probably use those in the bar. Holy shit, we got rain incoming. Nice. Oh, never mind, there's the heat advisory. Oh yeah, we're not supposed to get anything below 100 for a while. Yeah, this is bullshit. Ooh, hot rain. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a sauna. Hey, Charles. What school of magic would you say the universal yes. solvent would be? I have no clue. Oh. I'll look it up. I mean, maybe transmutation? That makes sense, actually. That... that uh... That's that's why I said goddamn. But two, one thing's become, yeah. That's why I said goddamn because I rolled a random loot and I have given you guys. I, the, <laughs> I gave you guys the glue last time and then this showed up. It happens. The universe loves it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, let's get out of the void. Oh wait, 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 wait. Oh yeah, so this is the opposite, right? Yeah. Yeah. 
I guess. I mean, transportation is the yeah, only thing that makes sense. Uh, yeah. One of the liquids gives you yeah, a both, yeah. heavy transmutation. Uh, aura. And the uh, last one... Uh, necromancy would give the most app. Yeah, necromancy would be the most app. Jar of uh, necro crap. The musical pipes. What was the fourth one? Uh, the ring. Yes. Oh, was a ring. Okay. Yeah, that was a ring. Enchantment. <laughs> the enchantment school. Alright. Well, that is one of the schools I deal with. Do I know what it does? Uh. Roll a DC arcane check. Uh, what's advantage since it is your school specialty? Or one of your specialties? Fifteen. <laughs> there was no escaping the seventeen. <laughs> seventeen was the side. So uh, this one you've actually seen and you've worked with one before. It was a ring of water walking. Hmm. I'll put the ring on. Yep, while wearing this ring, you can stand and walk on. Any liquid surface as if it was solid ground. Just like magma. Call me Jesus. I mean, I would still have people roll for fire damage. You're still, still going to take fire damage, but you can technically walk on lava without sinking into it. It's like... Resistant to fire. Yeah, it all works out. Alright, how much gold did you say there was again? 549. That's not that gold. Be like, hey, Milky. Yes. You want some gold? We got a lot of it. Oh, definitely. I would love some. I could uh, use it to buy some stuff when we get to town. If we don't find anything here. Uh, if you want to roll Arcana on the other uh, three items, uh, you can do a uh, flat r one up. The. Uh, Do I need to roll for each one? I uh, yes. So, uh, and do one with advantage. I will explain in just a moment why you need, you get advantage on it. All right. So the last two was the one I was going. Okay, so we're going to start with that. The, the reason you had advantage. Was I because it was a natural twenty. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so we're going to start with the last one first. The last one was the reason we got advantage on it was because it is the exact opposite aura that of something that you got recently, where you had the uh, sovereign glue. Yep. This is the universal solvent. The only thing that can dissolve it, the that, that can oh. get rid of the glue without the wish spell. You hold up both of them, they look like they could just fit together for some reason. It's like, why are these bottles made this way? Yeah, the bo the bottles are like almost designed to touch. Like it seems like they're like you put the two it's shampoo and conditioner. Yep, yeah, uh, pretty much. It, like whenever you touch the bottles to each other, it does perfectly fit together. Like you don't even have to. You could let go of one of them, and it actually will. The jars stay connected perfectly. So we got a sticky solution and something that appears to make it die. <clears throat> cool. Why don't we can use that if we don't have to uh, fight maybe a giant dragon or anything? Uh, the uh, necromancy one is uh, called the Pell Tincture. It's a poison. Oh, nice. 
If you don't mind, I would take that poison, yes? All right, but no drinking it. No, no, no. I would definitely apply it to my arrows and then shoot it at someone's throat. It just makes sense. Uh, I'm going to give him the poison. Okay. And the uh, pipes, which are the last thing, are referred to as the pipes of the sores. Oh, pipes of the sores. So you can summon some rats. <laughs> so uh, you do have to be proficient with one instrument to use these pipes. When you are attuned to the pipes, ordinary rats and giant rats are indifferent towards you and will not attack you unless you threaten or harm them. Does anyone know how to play this? I'm trying to figure out where the fuck my proficiencies are. Uh, I'm proficient with horns. <laughs> That's about it. I know how to play a mean trumpet. Uh, if no one else has it, then I will say that is close enough. <laughs> okay. That's literally the only tool proficiency I have. I figure out where the hell my proficiency. Oh, here they are. Uh, first page. Hey, uh, playing cards, so. smithy tools, thieves tools, so, three dragon anti set, tinker so, tools, and wood carving tools. So no musical instrument. Yeah. No, I'm good with making shit, not playing. You're good with actual stuff. I'm the weirdo that took a music class in high school. That's what it is. <laughs> where you took shop class. Like, I can't use these. Can either of you guys play this shit? Uh, Edwin, do you have the ability to play a musical instrument? I'm just going to kind of casually look up, like, and then just look back down, kind of just shaking my head. Oh, he's playing with the dead bodies. Sorry, that doesn't know. All right. I guess no, I'm it's playing yours, dragon though. chess right okay. now. I'm going to throw it over to you. This is the other pipes of the sewers. I'm also going to hand you uh, 183 gold coins. 183 gold coins. Got it. I'm going to walk over to the other guy and be like, hey, you. Here. I'm going to try to hand him some gold. Who, me? Yes, you. How much are you giving me? 183. Okay. It is a three-way split of what we have acquired. Yay. So no alcohol in this entire fucking town. Hmm. Maybe it's just one of them, you know, dry towns. Oh, I hate these kinds of towns. It deserves what it got. Yes. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know these people, but uh, the best freeing a dragon and giving all these people a draconic burial seems the best way that uh, we could have done this. It's better than they deserved. Uh. Big bird from the dragon. Alcohol, and uh, you guys also see uh, Drezik uh, walking into town. It's like, hey guys, did I miss a party? Oh shit, yes. dragon. No, don't worry. He, he's just going to eat touch it and leave. No. You're already you, full. You can it's ask him for some eat. people. Granted, these people were mostly poisoned. He like wipes off his mouth like, hey, how'd you know I have found something to eat? And uh, of course, homunculus is watching you. Oh, I completely... as I do this, the homunculus flies back over to me. Oh. Well, yeah, I, I had a good eat. Oh, by the way, the doctor and uh, what are you both dead? Do those I correlate know. together? Uh, yeah, it happened all at the same time. Like there was a big. There was a big old fight. Oh, okay. Uh, Woody was a coward. He deserved luck? his death. Uh, neither, neither here nor there. I didn't care for other people, so I don't necessarily care. Uh, does anyone want, like, a working sledgehammer? Like a working sledgehammer? Like a sledgehammer like that they may use at a smith or some. Oh, I do not have reason for that. Maybe Scar could. Yes, I'll take it. I'll add it to my smithing tools. I now have ample sense. Okay, guys, you ready to go back home? I, I, I think I'm tired of this. 
Yes. We, we will see you later, Sven. Bye, Sven. What the fuck is up with this? See you when you go to the cave. We'll visit you after the, like, we win. Oh, I forgot to move you guys back over, so you didn't see that I put <laughs> Trezic's token up. <laughs> oh, yeah, no. <laughs> okay, so, so... Oot. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and end the session with you guys getting back to town. Getting back to town. And taking a long rest. Uh, I mean, okay. you guys would, probably would have took a long rest before you guys left town because, yeah, because there's plenty of bedding. Like at least a day and a half to get here. Yeah, it's a day and a, it was a day and a half to get from the Dragonborn Sanctum to Vale and a day and a half to get to back to town. Right, I'd so, say that we go to freaking uh, talk to the clients beforehand, but I don't actually know who the fuck the clients are. Don't worry, I'll, I'll get to everything, and then I'll return back to you guys. Okay. I'm probably also going to go buy some armor. So, I, I'll meet you back at the shop. Okay. I'll tell you what, I'm, start, I, I'm starting to fucking act like a dragon over here with my money. <laughs> no, you're sharing it. That's not very much. Like, oh no, I, I was nice and shared that, but uh, it's not like you have like millions of gold that you haven't been telling us about constantly. Yes. No, I don't have millions. Oh, okay. 